First, I'd like to say I was totally embarrassed to see what happened to you, Peggy, and to see uh, someone receiving our tax dollars and treat you that way. It it really uh, it hit hit me right like right the, the chest there. Um, I uh, this is my district. I have like I have two of my children graduating from East Ramapo. Park. Also, I was at the uh, graduation recently at RCC, and my godson uh, just graduated from there. So I have a special affection for East Ramapo, and to see what, uh, see the twist that this, that this school, this school district has taken, it saddens me. And also, I remember I was here one year ago, uh, less than one year, what, what was it, during the fall, thank you. And I had it, had it out with the, uh, uh, the president of the board, also with the, uh, uh, the attorney, I think it was Mr. D'Agostino at the time. And nothing has changed. I wrote a letter when he had the incident with the, uh, the young student from our school and he refused to answer my letter but I say to Mr. D'Agostino the whole firm has to go right. yes. you cannot get rid of Mr. Kirby and retain the firm because they'll just move Mr. Kirby somewhere else you see what I mean? and the cycle goes on so I'm going to start coming back to these meetings, and and I give I stand here tonight with you and give you my pledge that I will be looking in on this, and I will not rest until I see something done here. Yes. That's pleasing yes. to all of us. Thank you, my friends, all of you. Thank you for coming out. And this is the way things are done. This is this is this is the way we we get. We, we get answers by you coming out and also at the voting polls. And you, you all know that we have a problem with our people coming out and vote. That's got to change. This coming September and on, let's get out and vote. That's right. And how about a hand for all of you? How about a hand for Peggy, the way she has conducted this meeting? And also, in closing, I'd just like to say, y'all have been a picture perfect as far as being uh, gentlemen and ladies tonight. And thank you, and God bless you once again.